Thank you for joining us on this 10th day of December 2010 for Right Now with Micah Sims. This is our daily video news blog providing you with the information you're going to need to make it through the day. Right now, on Fridays, which is the last day of the week, we do a commentary. We take one of the biggest stories from the week and I give you my inside perspective, my feeling about the story. Obviously, the biggest story of this week was President Barack Obama making a deal with the Republicans to extend the Bush tax cuts, extend unemployment benefits, and cut payroll taxes, amongst other things, for 2011. Let me give you my commentary. First of all, it is good to see President Barack Obama finally become presidential. Yes, this quick lesson in politics. You are nominated by a party. The American public votes for the two candidates for president. Usually the person with the most votes, sorry Al Gore, usually becomes the winner and becomes the president. At that point in time, the president not only represents the people who voted for him, but he also becomes the president for those who didn't vote for him. In other words, the president must oftentimes do or should do all the time what is in the best interest, not necessarily of his political party, but of the country. President Obama cut this deal for the betterment of the country. Number two, Democrats in Congress, why are you whining? You've had over four years of control of the Congress. You had enough time just in this calendar session to extend unemployment benefits to roll back the Bush tax cut. What happened? Where was the game plan? Where was the agenda? Where was somebody on the sidelines indicating that our time is running short and we need to get this done. Don't get upset at the president because you dropped the ball, because you didn't get done what you wanted to get done, and now all of a sudden you're upset that the president had to cut a deal. Number three, Republicans, can you stop being worried only about rich people? If you want to expand the tent, if you want to become more inclusive and not exclusive Republican Party, you are going to have to reach out to middle class. And by that, I mean there was no problem with you um, agreeing to extend unemployment benefits. Most people who are unemployed right now were at one time middle class residents of this country, citizens of this country. And all they need right now is for you Republicans, you Democrats, and the White House to agree to put together a plan that will get this country back working again. Yes, he has become presidential. Yes, he is going to look out for the betterment of the country. Yes, Democrats, you had your opportunity, and as in January, you will no longer be the majority in the House. Yes, Republicans, you need to be a little bit more inclusive. We'll be back with more right now with Micah Sims. Right now, it is the holiday season, and as you deliberate on what gifts to buy for your loved ones, as you decide where to actually purchase those gifts from, I would encourage you, I would ask that you would take into consideration some other people. Consider those soldiers who are fighting for our country on battlefields across this world. I would ask that you would take into consideration people who are laid up in hospital wards right now dealing with various illnesses. I would ask that you would take into consideration those that are behind prison bars. I would ask that you would take into consideration those that are without a home, those that scramble for food, those that scramble even right now for shelter. I would ask that you would consider those children that don't have a family right now. Because right now, 
you're using this holiday season hoping that it will provide the joy and love that you need to look forward to a better day in 2011. I would ask that you would hope that some way, somehow, that those people would find some joy and some happiness that would help them look forward to 2011 as an opportunity to make their life more better than what it is right now, even better than what it is right now. This is Micah Sims. Thank you for joining me for right now with Micah Sims. Have a great weekend, and we'll see you right here next week. As I always tell you, enjoy it, embrace it, and make the most out of it. See you next week.